Today's Screencastify is going to explain to you how to share a document while I am in Google Doc. The first thing I'm going to do is make sure my document has a title. So I'm going to title it Test Document. Um, then after I write in my document and get it the way I want it to be, and I know I want to share it with somebody else, I simply go up to the upper right hand corner where I have my share button. If you notice your share button has a lock on it, that means that it is not shared with anyone and that it's private only to you. Once I click the share button, um, up comes a menu where I can add email addresses. So for instance, if I want to share it with Shelly Fenton, I'll type in her name. Once I start typing the last name, all of the choices within our district will come up. So you'll be able to find email addresses easier. I can add as many people as I want and I can even add a whole contact list if I'd like to do that. Um, I can change my settings under the can edit button. The default is can edit, which means the person who you're sharing the document with can go in and edit it as they see fit. Or you can just select can comment, which means they can't change the actual document, but they can comment on it so you can see it. Lastly, I can give it a can view. And if it's can view, they really can't do anything to the document. If they want it, they have to make a copy of it first. Okay, so once I'm done and I'm going to keep mine on can edit, I simply hit send and now it is shared with one person. Uh, the biggest thing that you want to notice is up at the very top, you're going to see that if now the share button is different, there's not a lock on it anymore, I can see two people on it and that means it is shared with somebody else. Um, once I hover over it, it'll tell me how many people it's shared with. This says shared with one person, but I can have shared with 10 people, 20 people, however many you share it with. So I hope this helps. This is a great way to share and collaborate rather than using attachments like we used to do in Microsoft Word.